Hey, so I'm walking into the pet store. It's awesome here. Oh, hi. him up. They totally knocked him off. That's what happens when you don't share. That's cute. This should be big. Look at these. This is cute. Look at those over there. What happens when you're here in Mouse World? I get knocked off. Oh no, they're freaking out. Don't freak out. Oh. We used to have some of these. We had two. One was named Radar and one was named Bud. That mouse thing, it's cute. Scared of snakes. I don't like them. I'm not scared of those, but I, I saw a water moccasin. Oh yeah, okay. no, we ain't doing water moccasins. But if it's something like this that don't bite, or even something bigger like that, that that's not oh, if it's not poisonous. I don't know why snakes freak me out. Well, it's just a common thing. My snakes freak most people out. Yesterday, I saw the water moccasin swimming in a pond. Yeah, that would freak me out. And I got my BB gun, started trying to shoot at it, but it went under. Yeah. So I couldn't do it. Ha <laughs> look. I saw the uh, mice on the thing, and one didn't share, and two of them got on there and flipped it. <laughs> and I got it on video, too. <laughs> Are you videotaping? Yeah, I'm going to put this on YouTube. Okay. <laughs> I knew something cute like that would happen. 
Oh, hamsters. Yeah. Always. It's one of those itty bitty mice that were the, the little fluff balls that do nothing. Except run on the wheel. Why won't you be my friend and come back? My mom won't let me have mice. Little pet mice she are hamsters. Let you have a hamster. No, because she's scared of them. No, we have dogs. Okay. We have a dog that will absolutely kill it yeah. if she got the chance. She's a nice dog, but when she sees a hamster or a mice, she she's freaked out about it. She doesn't freak out. She just she we taught her to kill mice because we don't like mice, and she does it now. And she took it a little too literally. We had a pet squirrel once and somehow she got to it. It wasn't pretty. Oh, and we have a cat, so if I have one of those, if the dog doesn't get it, the cat will. Yeah, probably. So you'd have to upgrade to a guinea pig. Hmm? You'd have to have a guinea pig. Yeah. I want one. Or a chinchilla. It's a chinchilla. Oh my god, they're so cute. They're just like this. They're kind of like a bunny hamster. Yeah, my mom, my mom won't have rabbits but either. But they're like this big. Oh. So cute. I, I want to have a ferret, but no, that. The crystal will definitely. Parrots are pretty mean. That can be mean. Can crystal. Be crystal. She's a small dog. She's this big. She's a little white, short legged Jack Russell. Oh, she, she might. Is. Yeah. <laughs> now, who wants to go home with me? Are those bow constrictors? These are um, sand, uh, Kenyan sand boas. So they're not boa constrictors, but they're Oh, there's three of them. I thought there was only two. Yeah, so he shouldn't. There's, I heard that a lot of people are buying the boas and they get really, really big. And, and then, then they just, they, they just let them go. Yeah. I had a cousin who, well, she didn't just let her go. She called the wildlife people. And uh, it was huge. She had that thing for years. People get scared of it once it gets really big. So. Well, I've heard like horror stories of, you know, people who have really big snakes and then they have a baby and they just let the snake sort of roam free oh. and it'll eat whatever will go in its mouth. Yes, a few days ago I, um, I was doing something outside and I walked into our patio and there was a snake in the middle of the doorway, and I, like right when I was in the middle of it, I glanced at it and saw it, and jumped up and screamed. And the the um slide door slide on slide on it. It was like under the door. It was a little green snake, and we our it dog helped. Snake. Yeah, our dog helped us with it, but it didn't die. We let it go. But Chris, I was alone. I was alone, so. Ugh. Grass snakes are pretty sweet. Or they're not po poisonous or anything. They just eat like little insects and stuff. Chris, Crystal, my dog, helped me with that. It played dead for a little bit, but I thought it was dead. But then my mom came home and we figured out what it did. Oh, it freaked me out. I almost stepped on it. <laughs> yeah, if that's a poisonous snake.